Hey guys, this is the Don with Overlanding Anglers, and we just got back from our second trip, uh, exploring Oklahoma part two to Sparks, Oklahoma. And as you can see, we picked up a little bit of mud. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna compare some soaps. We've gotta get this thing clean. You don't want any mud sitting on your vehicle for any length of time. So we're gonna compare the Chemical Guys Tougher Mudder with some generic soap that we just bought at our local generic auto parts store that didn't want us to film inside there. So. Let's check out the before. We'll get the uh, power washer out, we'll spray, and then we'll check out the after. Let's do it. All right, guys, before we take a look at the two contenders we have for auto wash, I need to take a second and explain why it is super important to have a high quality auto wash to begin with, okay? As you guys can see, we have already washed the war machine here, and um, I really need to explain to you why. A lot of people might make fun of you calling you a mall crawler or a fake 4x4 guy if you have a clean vehicle, but realistically, taking care of your vehicle starts with washing it, all right? You've got to make sure your paint is clear, especially in Oklahoma, because we have this right here. This is red dirt, and there's a reason they call it red dirt. It's a reason they call red dirt country red dirt. It's because it sticks in your head. This stuff gets everywhere. And when it's wet, it's the consistency of a really thick, soupy mud that will stick to anything. Now, when it's dry, as you guys can see here, it is the consistency of just sand. And it is very, very coarse, and it is very, very hard on your vehicle. The red pigment in this will stain your, your paint if you don't pay attention to it, but more importantly, the consistency when it dries will destroy your bushings, will destroy your CV boots. And when that happens, you guys are in for a lot of repairs and a lot of costs that are unnecessary. So having a high quality auto soap, especially something that helps with this stuff uh, is really something that you guys might look into. So let's break out the contestants. We'll wash it like we already did. And we'll tell you which one won the uh, competition. So let's get started, okay? Okay guys, now, what we're gonna do is compare this $4 jug of generic car soap from our generic auto parts store to the Chemical Guys Tougher Mudder, okay? To keep everything fair, we're gonna use this Sun Joe Power Washer and we're gonna use this Chemical Guys Foam Cannon. All right, we are gonna mix this. We're gonna spray one side with the cheap stuff. The other side is gonna get the treatment Let's see how it does, okay? Let's get to it. After we start by wetting it down, let's go with our first contender, the generic car wash. After my special helper went back to going down her slide, we loaded up the generic soap in the foam cannon and started spraying. Now, as you can see, there's not a lot of foam, but there were a few bubbles and a fine mist. Here is the coverage we got. Now, we're gonna rinse it off and let's see how it does. Now, at first glance, it looks pretty good, but when you look closer, there's still mud right behind the front wheel on the driver's door and right behind the rear wheel on the quarter panel. Now, let's load up the Chemical Guys Tougher Mudder Soap and see how that does. Now, once we start wetting it down, we're gonna leave some of that red staining on there just to see how the soap will handle it. Once we got everything mixed up and foamed on, we had a much better coverage of the soap than we did with the bargain basement soap. Now, once the tougher mudder was rinsed off, we did not have any red stains left on the vehicle. Now here's a close up of the trouble spots that we had with the bargain soap. But as you can see, the tougher mudder took care of it. Now after we washed the bargain side with the tougher mudder, let's look at a before and after. All right, guys, as you can see, not only is the Forerunner cleaned up, but I am as well. Got a little hot and sweaty cleaning all that mud off. But uh, as you guys can see, the results really speak for themselves. The Tougher Mudder soap performed way better than just your average everyday soap that you're gonna find at your generic auto parts store. I got my uh, special helper here. What do you think, honey? Do you think uh, the yellow soap did better? <laughs> yeah? 
All right, guys. Well, until then, if you have any questions, let us know. We're going to post a link down below where you can find that soap on Amazon. Uh, click on that link. It'll take you right to it. But until then, until next time, we'll see you guys later. Bye.